before we get started, I'm Carly Ann. I'm gonna teach you how to draw. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so what is the line of action? The line of action is basically one line that sort of shows you the basic movement of your pose. Now, the thing that about it is that it can actually represent an emotion. So if you think about happy tends to turn upward, sad tends to turn down, anger tends to be more angular. And so you can actually sort of be thinking about the emotion of your pose, how the person is feeling when, when you draw it and how that affects it. All right, so let's say we're even starting with just a simple pose of someone standing. I will do the sort of line of action. It can be similar to where the spine is, but it's showing the basic movement of the pose. And then I like to draw the head and then the arms. and then the legs. Now notice I drew lightly here, so even if I make an oopsies, I can just draw a little darker and you don't notice it so much anymore, which is why it's great to draw lightly. Um, here we go, so here's my, my guy and he's sitting there and we have a little bit of movement in his body so it feels less stiff which is why the line of action is amazing. It helps you have less stiff drawings. All right, let's do another one. So this is for like a straight pose. Let's say you wanted someone to be jumping. So you might be like, oh my God. So my line of action is this. And then I might include the spine here and then I'll do the head. I like to put a little line to show which way the head is looking. So he's looking up or her. And then I'll add my arms. And there we go, now we have this happy jumping pose. Okay, this is pretty dramatic. We can also have something more quiet. So let's say someone is sad and they're sort of bent over. So you see I did this sort of line here and then the head. Maybe then there's their legs and they're holding on. Again, notice how I did this line inside of my circle to show that they're now, this is looking down, curves down. Looking up, it curves up. Then we can also do someone who's maybe, and maybe someone's angry. See, now we're getting more angular. <laughs> I did not plan this pose out beforehand. We're just seeing what's happening here. And just this line that I originally drew gives us that sense of anger and it will give us a more interesting pose. That's it. a weird spider. I love it. Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, so angry. <laughs> and that is how I use the line of action in my drawings. All right. If you guys enjoyed this, my next video is going to be about having an interesting pose so that it's not, oh, I'm not going to tell you why. I'm just going to show you how to have interesting poses. If you want to see that, subscribe and you'll know when it's up. <laughs> All right. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.